Hello all you beautiful thrill seekers, my name is Coach Shadong Snowborn, Bob built for theme parks and welcome to a theme park news update from Fuji Q Highland. This is not about the 2022 coaster, however it could potentially link to the coaster because we've got a brand new viewing platform being built for next year on the Fujiyama roller coaster. Now, this was originally rumoured to go, however, it is not to go anywhere. Get it? To go? Togo? Anyway, um, before we get started though, I'm sure you're wondering where the updates have been on this, the Drayton Manor fire. Uh, I want to give my heartfelt apologies to Drayton Manor and my heartfelt condolences to them and also a massive, massive praise to the Staffordshire Fire and Rescue Service. It was amazing what you guys did uh, to put out the blaze. Um, it was in a toilet block in a store cupboard in Thomas Land. Uh, that's pretty much nearly destroyed. Uh, thankfully, no one, human or animal, was hurt. Uh, so the investigation is still underway as to what happened with that. Uh, I wasn't going to put out an update on this because, you know, I didn't want to. I didn't want to be one of those idiots that just speculates, you know, after such a tragedy. Um, thankfully, no one was hurt, but I didn't want to be one of those idiots who speculated about it. So I wanted to put in an introduction in this first video today. Uh, just to say my heart goes out to Drayton Manor and also well done to the Staffordshire Fire and Rescue team for putting that out. Um, but let's get straight into this then. So please like, comment, subscribe, click the catch bell so you never miss a YouTube video. Make sure you uh, comment down below your questions for the Christmas Eve Q&A for 2000 subs celebration video. Use the hashtag question before or after your question. Torch went off. Hurrah. Um, also guys, make sure... Uh, you are getting down below to the description to go for Twitter, TikTok, Snapchat, Instagram, and much, much more. And for now, guys, let's go into this and let's have a look exactly what's going on uh, with FujiQ Highland and their brand new viewing platform for the Fujiyama coaster. So while well, the new coaster is for the 2022 season, they've announced a new viewing platform. You can see some concept art on your screen. Uh, so this is ending speculation that the Fujiyama is not to go anywhere um, there's also an edge walk and a slide involved so it's definitely a, a very very interesting I mean you can see by the um, sort of look of the tower it's the king of coaster towers so it's um, it's it, it, it looks amazing doesn't it I mean the the work that goes into this is unbelievable um, and you know you get to see this viewing platform you get to um, to see a panoramic view of Mount Fuji. It's going to be completed by the summer of 2021, according to the Fuji Q uh, website. Um, this is planned to be constructed to make daily inspections smoother, as Fujiyama, King of Coasters, will be the completion of the inspection tower. It's possible to inspect from the middle of the course. It'll be possible to carry replacement parts and equipment at once using the elevator inside the tower, which will enable higher level inspection. The view from Mount Fuji from the observatory, which is about 55 meters high, is just overwhelming. You can see by the concept are already on your screen. It looks amazing. Uh, now there's the King of Coasters walk, which goes around a windswept passage without handrails with a harness attached. And the tube type slider that slides down from the observation floor to the bottom at once. Um, now also with this... Um, this links to the speculation which we spoke about at the beginning of this report that Fujiyama could have been going uh, at some point in the near future. However, it is staying at the park. We've got a Togo that's not going anywhere. Um, but this will also provide great views for the rest of the park, including for their brand new coaster for 2022. Now, we don't know exactly what's going to happen yet. We don't know who the manufacturer is. We don't know what's going to happen. We know the price tag. It's about 30 million odd. So, you know, it's, 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 it's an expensive coaster. Um, and it's it's very interesting indeed to see what's going to happen for 2022. Um, now, in terms of the Fujiyama, for those of you who need a bit more details about this coaster, um, it's a Togo sit-down that operated, it's been operating since 1996 uh, with a length of 6,708.7 feet of track. Wow. With a height of 259.2 feet, a drop of 229.7 feet, a speed of 80.8 miles per hour, a vertical angle of 65 degrees, a duration of 3 minutes 36, and a g-force of 3.5. So this is an interesting story, and I can't wait for this inspection tower to open. So there we go, Thrill Seekers. That is talking about the Fujiyama King of Coasters walk and the tube type slide. 
are and also talking about the inspection tower which will it will all accumulate uh, in the middle of passage of Fujiyama. Now of course this will be great views of Mount Fuji to experience next year. Uh, new views of the 2022 coast are being built and of course you could go up there you know once the coast is built in 2022 as well. Um, and of course it's a great way to keep modifying and maintaining the Fujiyama coaster. I think now correct me if I'm wrong but I reckon once Fujiyama's time com does come to an end I reckon they could build a brand new coaster around that passage tower that inspection tower I reckon they could do another coaster like a dive machine or something I reckon they could do something with Fujiyama's spot in the future to go around that inspection tower and do a nice view element or something this is setting up for something really special in the future but I think for now at least we can just Revel in the fact that a classic Togo coaster is not going anywhere. Uh, but there we go, guys. So thank you very much for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe for more. We've got plenty more content coming uh, over this month and into January. So stay tuned for all of that. And for now, guys, my name is Coast Chow. Coop living the coast life. And I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have a Fuji-tastic day. Woohoo!